Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? The Axe is your boy Daddy Easy here. I pod Jabberic Hacker, otherwise known as Don't Easy Me Tomahawk. Some of you may know me as Easy, like I always say, to the black, to the blue, my avatar on my YouTube channel. Yeah, buddy. So, um, this is a little fast video that I'm doing real, real quick. Sorry if y'all see me keep pandering over towards the other part of the screen. It's because that's where my monitor is basically at and connected at. So, fast little update. I got some unboxings that I did. Try to do it quick. Did an unboxing for the Nikon, uh, Nico, Nikon, or Nikon D3300. Just can't figure out why. I just can't say that name correctly. But um, did another unboxing for that another camera. Purchased another one. So yeah. Also did an uh, unboxing for the Canon all-in-one printer, scanner, fax machine, uh, all that good shit. Now I'm not gonna make you guys wait any longer. Uh, basically what's going on is I get all of my products tomorrow from Newegg so basically I purchased the i5 uh, i5 6500 um, GP sorry CPU uh, this is Skylake and I believe it's 5th gen I'm not completely sure but it's running LGA 1151 my motherboard right here as you can see behind me is 1151 this is the RGB motherboard it's the ASUS Pro Gaming, actually the ASUS B150 Pro Gaming Aura. That's what RGB um, on the L the motherboard itself. Only problem that I'm having with it, I should have paid more attention to it because on a header it only has uh, two USB headers on it. I need three USB headers, especially for the front panel of my PC, my Hue Plus, and my NZXT. Um, that's in my Hue Plus. Yeah, the NZXT Hue Plus, my Kraken X41, and my front panels for my uh, PC that's actually using that. I do have thermal compound on the top. I have 120, I'm sorry, 1 gigabyte, one gigabyte Western Digital Blue uh, at 7200 RPMs. So, just picked it up because it was cheap. I had a lot of money left over from all the things I used to buy from Best Buy and my motherboard. So the things that's coming inside the mail tomorrow is my Avexor Core Series. I got 16 gigabytes of it, so um, four sticks of it. It came out to $79. Um, a lot of you guys is probably like, uh, you know, other things. I do have Avexor sponsoring me. I'm just waiting for them to email me back. I should get the email back from them either tonight or tomorrow, which is Friday, and let me know if they're going to send me the uh, Red Tactical red uh teslas and the um impact series but i am going to be doing a review for the core series that i get from a vector i'm going to let them know that i purchased the vector ones uh, i'm sorry that i purchased the um core series ones and we'll put that up towards the review also once they sell it towards me also so pc build will be tomorrow i need to get my wife a new case instead of giving her the gateway i might probably pick up a, a nzxt s340 get that for her or a Corsair case and give that to her and let her have her own case uh, with the stuff because she's going to get my GPU that's already inside this PC the motherboard the RAM everything so she's going to have the GPU one thing I want to say to you guys before I get off this video um, I'm part of the F what is it I can't pronounce the name F fair after I don't know the name of it program basically what happens is uh, I tell y'all to go to the website, y'all to lease it, use me as a reference, you get $5, I get $5, and your bill, rental, basically get cut down. reason why I'm doing the leasing for my GPU is, y'all know I'm moving, I cannot spend no more money, um, I have to hold money in my pocket for security deposit, so I can't spend no more money. I have already went out and brought another camera, a uh, Canon D3300, and we went out and brought a printer. So can't spend no more money I've been overspending plus I just spent money on that i5 processor and for the RAM so I cannot spend no more money that's why I'm not picking up a GPU I can pick me up a GPU but I'd rather rent it out for 41 bucks right now and pay it off on June which I must drop $400 paid this month which is March April May paid again for three months um, in June I'll just pay it in a full, and that'll be it. And why not upgrade into a new uh, GPU, which I got a feeling the GTX 990 is gonna wind up coming out. 
is the 990 coming out? I don't know. Is it even real? No. I just got a feeling that a 990 is going to come out sometime this year. And I want to be able to purchase that. Because if you look at it, you see how you had a 950, 960, 970, 980. I got a feeling a 990 is going to come out this year. So I want to wait for that. So I'm getting the um, Gigabyte. Uh, uh, GTX 970 and I'm going to lease that like I said I'm pay for that out but I'm going to put that um, program stuff in my description of my next videos once I receive the GPU I'm not going to do it right now I'm not going to do it until I actually get the GPU I spoke to the guy he said I could do a review so in that video I'm going to put the link to that code so you can start leasing your GPUs and stuff like that but guys I'm going to get done and I will catch you guys in my next video remember live it love it game and peace and deuces and I'll catch you guys later that's it. I'm up.